I first was introduced to Focus Ultrasound about a year ago when we were going to launch this program here at Houston Physicians Hospital. And what an incredible technology. I was overwhelmed with that first and foremost. The day the patient is coming for the Focus Ultrasound treatment, typically what we see is patients that are a little nervous. At the end of the day though, they found the place where they need to be to feel good about it. They've had their questions answered. I heard about the ultrasound treatment through uh, research on my own. When I noticed that <laughs> my hair was going to be shaved and everything, I got the cold feet. But my tremors, you know, wasn't getting any better. I said I got to go ahead and get it done. So that's why I'm here today. One of the reasons why the patients are so bold and so brave to come is because this has been a debilitating condition for them for so long. Our CEO, Heather Womack, believes that this is such a major life-changing event for the patient that she wants to make sure their family members are here to help experience it. When I first saw my mother um, shaking, of course it's your mother and you, you, know, you feel sorry for her. Just to see it um, happening and in action, it, you know, it just doesn't make you feel good. I'm hoping that she'll you know, get her social life back and I'm just looking more for her happiness. You're doing great. This is why you're here. After the ultrasound treatment, I'm hoping to be able to go out and eat with my friends and family. I just want a normal life. I want to get back to things. I want to socialize. I just want to get my life back. I you know, don't like seeing my mom upset or depressed, so that's mostly what I'm looking for. Um, I, just, I just want her to be happy. The coolest part of Focus Ultrasound treatment for me is the immediate effect the patient feels. So of course, when they're in the MRI machine, periodically they're slid out, they do some drawings, they hold a glass that has a cap on it to feel the sensation of what drinking might be like. And they can tell one round or two rounds into it, this is different, my hand feels different, my hand feels better, my hand feels steadier. This holding a pen feels completely different. Look at the line I can draw. And we haven't even finished the treatment. And I just think that is miraculous. If your lifestyle has changed drastic like mine, you can't hold a glass of water or having problem eating. You don't want to go out to the restaurant and eat because you're shaking. Your lifestyle is just not what it used to be. I encourage you to seek this treatment. Do they research like I did? You should have a detailed conversation with your physician regarding the risks and benefits of treatment options prior to treatment. The most common complications reported by subjects in Insight Tech-sponsored clinical studies after treatment included imbalance, gait disturbance, numbness, tingling, and headache, head pain. Most complications were classified as mild or moderate, and 48% resolved on their own within 30 days. Additional infrequent events included dizziness, taste disturbance, slurred speech, fatigue, and vomiting. Persistent complications at three years included numbness, tingling, imbalance, unsteadiness, gait disturbance, and musculoskeletal weakness. For complete safety information, please visit essential-tremor.com slash safety-information.